Los Angeles released 4,000 prisoners, I believe. Or sure. was it more than that? I don't know. It's happening all, all over the country. They're prisoners. Because <laughs> they're... I think it's even happening right here. Their employees are, are unwilling or unable to come to work. Huh? And... They just don't have enough staff to take care of these people. We've had two sure. prison near riots in Kansas <coughs> last week. <coughs> and I'm betting it's because of understaffing. I know of some counties where they've gone through and did a, done an essential analysis of people sitting in jail. And are, are most of ours probation violations or? Yes. That's what I was thinking. I think I know the county you're talking about because I watched their web page to see who's in there and all of a sudden there was a huge drop in how many people were in jail. Well, if you don't and, have the staff. You know, here's something that, that is concerning is that there are some counties where if you have a domestic situation, they won't take them and put them in jail. And that's mandatory. Yeah, that's part of it. You shall. <laughs> yeah, exactly, you shall. But I know of some counties around here that um, they book and release. I think that's opening up to a and, liability night. Well, Cody and I have had a conversation, and it's like they didn't change the yeah. laws. The yeah. laws are still the same, and so we will find a jail. Because that will come happens. back and haunt somebody mm -hmm. somewhere. Exactly, someone's going to get hurt. Yes. Well, we'll carry on business the best we can and hope for the best. Do we have any other business we need to talk about today? Scott? I think so. Motion to adjourn. Second. All those in favor? Aye. Aye.